Hi friends, good morning. This is Ashok Raj. So in this video, we are going to discuss about uh, why we are uh, switching off the uh, power factor bank when we are switching on the DG. So this is the uh, one of the most interview question. Uh, so uh, generally, if AFPS, uh, AFPS, it means that what automatic power factor correction panel, right? So generally, why we are installing AFPS? So uh, we are installing AFPS to improve the uh, our power factor. Okay. So when the power factor we are maintaining the power factor at very uh, lagging, and what will happen? The our government authority uh, will, uh, uh, will, uh, will will uh, will 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 give the penalty to us. Okay. So to avoid that penalty, so we are uh, uh, putting the AFPS at our uh, substation or otherwise our in our. Uh, uh, other uh, uh, MV panel and uh, your load. Okay, so so regarding that uh, AFPS, right? So how to calculate that uh, KVR? Okay, so already I have uh, done the video. So how to calculate the KVR based on your maximum load? So I am just explaining that formula again. So KVR is equal to P into tan phi one minus tan phi two. That is the formula. So how to calculate the KVR, I have explained very clearly in my last video. So that uh, video is available in I think all the three languages. It is available. So uh, I am giving that uh, uh, video link in the in this video description. Okay, you just uh, uh, make a visit of it so that uh, you will get the concept. So now uh, coming to the topic again. So why we are uh, why we are uh, uh, switching off our uh, power factor correction panel when our DG is running. So there are three reasons behind that uh, behind uh, this concept. One is what our alternator get in, uh, our alternator winding will get damaged. Our alternator winding will get damaged. Alternator winding will get damaged and increase in voltage. Increase in voltage and uh, third one is. Uh, Uns unnecessary unnecessary load changes okay so these are the three main factor in order to avoid these uh, things we are uh, switching up the automatic power factor correction panel generally <coughs> so the first thing I, I will explain why alternate winding will get uh, increased okay so see if you if you go through that that uh, your name plate of your DG and there will be a power factor is 0.8. It means that the DG is always uh, designing uh, designing the full load of the that the DG is designing for the with respect to the 0.8 power factor. Okay, so if it is a 0.8 power factor, then what is the maximum load of your DG? So it is very simple. So I am just writing here so that uh, it will be very easy. Okay, kilowatts equal to kVA into power factor right this is the general formula so i am uh, just uh, putting this uh, assume that i have a 1000 kva dg okay so kilowatts equal to i am putting 1000 here and power factor is 0.8 so what will come it is 800 kilowatt so when our dg is running at 0.8 power factor our load is 800 kilowatt now again i want to i just adding that uh, I, I, I didn't uh, switch on our uh, automatic power factor correction panel. So when our uh, uh, load, uh, when uh, when the DG is running, right, then the power factor maybe is 0.9 or otherwise one it will go up to one. So based on our KVR rating, okay. So the again you just putting that value in power factor. I mean in this formula, KV is same only thousand, and power factor is now became one, okay. So thousand KV, thousand kilowatt, right. So whenever uh, if if you are choosing any equipment, right, it will not uh, uh, we cannot put the maximum load, the design load we cannot put. Okay, so we we can we can put the load around eighty to ninety percent, right? Is it not? So if uh, we are using eighty percent of load here, so it will comes around four forty uh, kilowatt. It means that we can we we can put the load up to six forty. That is a safe load. Okay. And here, if we consider at 80% load, it will come around 800 kilowatt. So, see here. So, your, your DG is only designed for six, uh, to, uh, 
cater for the uh, 640 uh, kilowatt of load while you are uh, you are not switching on the your uh, perfector panel the load is automatically getting increased it is up to 800 kva if uh, the people we may ask uh, may think that sir we have lot of uh, production system in our dg so when the dg when the load is increased is automatically trip so assume that your load uh, uh, all the production will get uh, uh, damaged assume that your your uh, production every production is damaged in the, in such case what will happen the load will automatically increase to 800 kilowatt if, if you have such a load it will automatically increase to 800 kilowatt and what will happen the alternate binding will get increased uh, will get damaged why because it is designed for only catered to 640 kilowatt if you are applying more than uh, that uh, uh, load right your alternator winding will get uh, alternate winding will get damaged this is the one of the reason we have to switch up the power factor panel when our dg is running and second thing increase in volt so increase in volt is nothing but power power is equal to root 3 vi cos 5 this is the standard formula you know right in case of three phase so here the power so assume that here the power is proportional directly proportional to cos phi the power is directly proportional to uh, current the power is directly proportional to voltage when the power factor increases so when uh, when when i am switching I, I didn't switch on the uh, automatic power factor correction pedal our power factor will automatically will increase assume that it is one so what will happen power factor increases my power will increases my power will increases my voltage my uh, current will increases my power will increases it also increase the voltage level all right so if my voltage level is get increased okay so what will happen in dg we have a avr avr is nothing but automatic voltage regulator it always maintain the our accessible voltage when we when uh, uh, just uh, as in that 450 to 450 440 right it will always try to i am just giving the example right so it is the avr is always uh, try to uh, try to maintain the voltage within the limit if the voltage suddenly increase what will happen this avr will trip your dg right so this is the one of the reason we have to in order to avoid that uh, dg is uh, getting switch off automatically we have to switch off the kvr your kvr uh, panel that is our afps panel okay and second thing is unnecessary load increase it means that what uh, suppose you have uh, 1000 uh, uh, okay 100 kv ER, okay 100 kv ER. you have 100 kv ER capacitor band right so initially assume that it is a three phase 10 kv ER usually uh, produce 10 kv ER usually produce 13 to 40 amps the formula is uh, you know the formula what is the formula current is equal to q current is equal to q total by root 3 v 1.732 into 1.73 okay 1.732 into voltage so this is the uh, basic formula that is power is equal to v in tie right here the power is reactive power so reactive power q is equal to so uh, if you want uh, current right then it will go down this voltage will go down this is the formula i is equal to q by root 3 vi if, if you are choosing the line voltage if you are using the phase voltage and you have to put 3 here okay so if you are calculating such a way you, you will get for 10 kbr you need uh, around uh, 13 to 14 14 amp, 14 ampere uh, uh, it will be loaded into a dg assume that your 100 your 100 all the 100 kbr is loaded into a dg right so what will happen around 100 cents into 10 you are putting 10 uh, 10 uh, into 10 times so 130 amps to and 140 amps the sudden load is increased in your dg but this is not a real power that is a reactive power that is that is the problem so what will happen if the it is unnecessary load right if you if you if you want your load if you want to utilize utilize the dg for your load then you have to cut this reactive power or otherwise your dg is uh, uh, unnecessarily running for your reactive power and your diesel will get uh, consumed more compared with your uh, uh, your uh, 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 regular consumption so in this all to avoid in all the three uh, such a cases so we have to switch off the your uh, automatic power factor correction panel so when your dg is running okay so this is the most of the interview question whenever you go they will ask uh, this is a, actually this is a basic question most of the person will know about it so those who don't know hope i i, I have explained the, uh, this very clearly
so uh, that's it so today topic is uh, that's it so if you like this video please do uh, subscribe our channel so nowadays we are trying to uh, uh, trying to put the uh, any all the video in all the three languages tamil english and hindi so to cover the most of the audience right so a lot of person are asking me to put the uh, i mean uh, put the video in english so so i am doing so as per your uh, requirement so hope you will support me more compared with uh, as usual so thank you thank you for watching my channel if you like this video please do react with uh, uh, please uh, like or dislike or put uh, if you have any queries and put uh, your queries in the comment box so thank you thank you for watching my channel and keep supporting thank you bye bye